Vault. Yeah, Film Vault. Welcome to Film Vault. I'm Brian Bishop with Anderson over there. Yeah, today, the big summer movie recap, 2012. We're going to tell you the top five films that came out this summer. Hey, Brian, will you be quiet for a minute? You enjoy the music? I really am. This is phenomenal. Is this your kind of thing? This is like Butthole Surfers meets Fart Park. This is some good shit right here. Who is the uh, featured artist? We'll get to that in a second. No, I want to know now. They're the Melted Cassettes. Oh, really? Yeah, the Melted Cassettes. Sounds kind of like that. I get that. This is a sound like a melt cassette. Give me that or the Raping is all Cats. The, is all the music like this, Logan? Yes, it's pretty weird this week. Nice. Weird. Okay. So, if you do like it, good for you. If you don't like it and you, you're in a band, you make music, this is a call to you to say, get your ass in gear and send us some music to be a feature artist for the week. That's off earlier in the show. Okay. So, uh, this is going to be a uh, difficult episode, I can why, tell already. Why is that? Brian's not in a good mood. Brian's in a No, Brian's never in a bad mood. Brian's in a sunny bad Brian, mood. Sunny Brian? Sunny side up, Brian? Pulled, pulled up in the parking lot out there. I was out there with Catherine Wood smoking a cigarette. And, you were uh, out there by yourself. <laughs> yeah, so good times. Yeah, some more of the melted cassettes. Yeah, coming up next. That was Logan suddenly trying to cut me off and say, don't spoil it. Yeah. Is that a new I iPhone, so. by the way? Is that the iPhone 5? No. Yeah, it is. It's the Galaxy. Wow, and you're asking people to pay for your honeymoon. Hey, man, I had the fucking iPhone 2, and I've been waiting for four fucking years, okay? Put it on a credit card. You know, as people in Africa who don't even know what an iPhone is. Yeah, they know what flies are, though. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, they, <laughs> Full of the iFly 7. <laughs> Coming to Africa. Wow, that's awful. Wow. Come on, let's get up there. I'll eat you and feed you. Coming up next, Summer Movie Recap. Oh, Anderson. Mm. Love is in the air. Love is in the air at Amazon. People have been clicking through, and uh, someone clicked through and bought a... Uh, Are we doing a February one right now? The fuck? Is this for... No! Sorry, I did that. Thanks, you guys. Hi, I'm Lucy Liu. You're listening to the Film Vault on AndersonandBrian.com. Hope you're all enjoying the uh, dulcet tones of the melted cassettes. This sounds a little bit like Rats from uh, Ransom. Billy uh-huh. Corrigan's uh, project. When oh, he did I know that, what that is. That movie, that uh, Ransom movie with uh, Mel Gibson. Oh, that's a crazy soundtrack. It was my top five soundtracks. It oh, sounds very yeah, similar right. to the music that... Uh, I forgot about that. You're right. Lily Taylor. Lily Taylor? Yeah, Lily Taylor. Make sure to listen to. I think it was Donnie. Was it, it Donnie? Little Kid? No, it was, uh, it, was, uh, it was Donnie Wahlberg, I think. Could be wrong, but I think it was Lily Taylor and Donnie Wahlberg, and they had the little kid, Nick Nolte's real-life son, and they were drinking, they were, they were feeding him Robitussin and playing this kind of music. <laughs> wow, turn it up. I turned down. We're losing listeners. It was, they're actually torturing his brain with music like this. Like, Thank you, Glendale, Arizona's own Melted Cassettes. MeltedCassettes.com or check them out at AndersonandBrian.com. That's how they create their music is they just make a really nice, uh, like you said, like dulcet phones. And they just put their cassettes in, into uh, like a car in the middle of uh, Arizona, Glendale, Arizona, and then they play it back. That's probably, what it sounds like. probably every cassette in Glendale, Arizona is melted. It sounds like Michael Buble when they actually produce it and then they put it in the car. Yeah. For a couple of days it's all in the heat, and then they play it back. That's right. That's inventive. It's a good call, Michael Buble. Buble. Mikey Bubbles, as okay. I call him. Yeah, we're right, and you I just go? sue someone for. All right, think about it over the break. No, where were we? The music swell. An IMAX. Oh, an yes, IMAX. IMAX. Kill the music. <laughs> <laughs> so you the music's can, killing you us. You can look. The music is not killing us. It's invigorating. I need to work out to this music. You know, spastic. I look on a stairmaster while listening to this. I look like an animation. That's right. <laughs> oh, I should also say that uh, you would look like one of those like inflatable dolls they have outside of uh, outside of car washes. Uh, Paranorman was uh, one of the directors. Uh, did Flushed Away, which I was uh, which I was delighted by. I really like that Flushed Away, but the, uh, the the slick rat. Finish your thought. Lives in a toilet. Uh, <laughs> I'm Max. Yeah, so you can look up uh, on the, the old internets there and find a, uh, if you want to see, like, say, Dark Knight Rises playing in IMAX theater, they'll show you where they're playing in IMAX. You can go, you can pay the extra 3 or $4 or whatever for fry IMAX. You go in there, and the, and it's not a, it's not a true IMAX. Uh, it's not shot with It's like IMAX a regular, camera. no, it is shot with an IMAX camera, but it's not projected on an I, oh, actual IMAX screen. Oh. That is false advertising. It's like my fucking bachelor party where the two whores that showed up, two hookers, I'm sorry, two strippers, two ladies of the night, were not the ladies that were picked off the internet. That's upsetting. Yes, it's false advertising, Brian. But yeah, I went to the 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 screen was like just a normal screen, but they cut off the sides to give it a different aspect ratio. That's upsetting. 
that was really upsetting. So that's how I first saw Dark Knight Rises. I'm uh, like, that's probably why I didn't like it. That's how sour you want it. So I went to see it in the true IMAX down the street. Same effect, though. Yeah. Didn't like it as much. Coming up next, the conclusion to our summer recap. <laughs> Yeah, buddy. Um, Logan came to us with this harebrained idea. Yeah, Logan's trying to earn that 15% this week. Back to the show. Yeah, I like this one. Thanks, Melted Cassettes. From Glendale, Arizona, meltedcassettes.com. Oh, there's the screen. <laughs> <gasps> oh, my plum mom. Number two. It's like langostino, Brian. How do they call that lobster? That's not lobster. That's like, like saltwater crayfish. Doesn't taste like lobster, but they're like, hey, lobster uh, tacos, come on and get them. Yep. Come on. Sorry. Okay. We'll get on another race next week. That's it, right? It, it, yeah, thanks, everyone. Thanks, the melted cassettes, or they're just melted cassettes. Meltedcassettes.com. They were our feature artists. For information on how to become a feature artist, go to andersonandbrian.com. That's where you go for everything. Oh, that's where you go to. Logan, we have a link there to nominate or to uh, do the whole st- the Stitcher Award thing? Yep, there's a okay. banner right on the homepage of andersonandbrian.com. What about the uh, plan of having the top five uh, listener listener's choice where they pick uh, it's the top five listeners what they want us to flick fast, and then we just do a top five listener? Huh? We'll work on that when you get back from your honeymoon. Wow, you just keep pushing. Is it a lot of work for you there, bud? That's right. A lot, a lot of work? No, I just think we got, we, got our, we got our next four episodes planned, so. Okay. Sniff Tracks number two still available. People still tweet me and say, hey, I just bought it, so I appreciate it. What the fuck took you so long? Maybe you don't understand like the, the situation, though. It's like they got to pick five, and then we have to have at least a few weeks to be able this to watch all, all five. all off-air right? discussion. It's this true. All You're saying it with the same cadence that I normally do. Production. This is all off-air discussion. Okay. Sorry. Thank you for clicking through the Amazon banner. We appreciate it. Right there on AndersonandBrian.com. Any of your uh, Amazon needs, we're uh, here to help. Or just collect uh, a little bit of pennies off what you do. Uh, comments on the episodes. I appreciate the comments. They're uh, quite funny. In fact, we should start highlighting some of the funnier ones. Uh, some people, uh, well, you're going to find this hard to believe, Anderson, you're divisive. Oh, really? Yeah, some sure. people hate, some people like. I don't look at those comments. No, anymore. some people hate, some people really hate. <laughs> You're so fun. Hey, a list so of all the films discussed. I actually used the list of films discussed uh, this week when I was looking for when did I talk about Prometheus and when did I talk about blah, blah, blah. So I went back and I looked. Check it out at AndersonandBrian.com. Oh, it's all there. And uh, just this like music's to say, freaking me out. Thanks again to everyone who does do the extra click and clicks through on the Amazon. It, it does, uh, keeps the show running. Keeps the coal burning. That's right. And uh, I know that you got a lot of choices, like we say every week. But uh, it's just it's it's unbelievable that you guys continue to be uh, loyal listeners and uh, thank us back by, by watching all the movies, so you don't have to watch all of them. You can just watch the good ones. That's and what we keep, do. Keeps Logan is Logan someday is going to be able to pay for that uh, iPhone five. That's true. That's right. Logan and I with Keep our iPhone. We're gonna we're gonna do a little high five right now with our iPhone five. An i five. Yeah. Uh, i five. Uh-huh. I had immediate regret once it showed up <laughs> on my on my door. First of all, it was shipped from China. Speaking of China, oh. I thought it was going to be coming from San Jose. That's how long it's been since they got a new phone, Brian. Apple's in, uh, oh, fuck, where are they? China. Brian. No, no, no. They're close to San, San Jose. Jose. Cor- Corpet- Cupertino. 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 Yeah. That's it. Thank you. Uh, yes. Check us out. The Film Vault. We're on uh, Facebook, so, uh, Facebook.com slash The Film Vault, Twitter at The Film Vault, et cetera, et cetera. That's it. Wow. Oh, hey, Miss Movies coming up soon. Check her out, by the way. It's, Miss uh, Movies and Miss Movies Minute. And possibly. Hmm. This movie is with newborn child. That'd be awesome. That could have delivered on air. That's what I'm saying. That'd she could amazing. get so excited that the uh, God damn it, it's gross that they have a mucus plug. That just makes me All right. fucking sick. Who are we doing it for? Unbelievable. Oh, I'm never getting her pregnant. I'm never getting my lady pregnant. pregnant. Oh, you said her. I thought you meant this movie. I'm like, I don't think you will. We're doing it for Mango. <laughs> the music's freaking me out.